As Israeli civilians are butchered by Palestinian terrorists, the truth about the Israeli-Palestinian conflict is also being butchered by a campaign of vicious lies. The biggest lie is that Israel is trying to change the status quo on the Temple Mount. Last year, some 3.5 million Muslims, 200,000 Christians, and 12,000 Jews visited the Temple Mount. Only Muslims are allowed to pray on the Mount. Non-Muslims may visit only at specified times, which have not changed. Though the Temple Mount is Judaism's holiest site, where Solomon built his temple some 3,000 years ago, Israel will not allow a change in the status quo. The ones trying to change the status quo are Palestinians, who are violently trying to prevent Jews and Christians from even visiting a site holy to all three faiths. Since 1967, Israel has vigorously protected the holy sites of all faiths, including Al-Aqsa. In the Middle East, where militant Islamists desecrate and destroy churches, synagogues, world heritage sites, as well as each other's mosques, Israel is the only guarantor of Jerusalem's holy places. Palestinians have been propagating the Al-Aqsa is in danger myth since at least 1929. Nearly a century later, the mosque remains unharmed. But the lie persists. Incitement kills. Lies kill.